And today Marimba One sent me 32 pairs of their mallets. These are three brand new mallet series that we've never seen before on this show. These are some of the cheapest Marimba One mallets I've ever seen. Concert Soloist Oriented Mallet Series. We've got the Front Ensemble Series, which is just called the Front Ensemble Series. And finally, we have the Vibraphone Mallet Series. I'm gonna let you guys choose which one I review first. Oh, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of The Studio. My name is Adam. And today, Marimba One sent me 32 pairs of their mallets. Let's check them out. Thank you so much to my studio VIPs, Robert Utomo, Will Flinnar, Ryan Carlisle, Sung Shun Han, Greg Harris, Don Dominic Chung, DMP Newberger, Scott Rader, and Marimba Maurice. Thank you so much for your continued support. And today's feature studio artist is Arn. Thank you so much for joining the studio artist team. And if you'd like to become a studio VIP or a studio artist, you can go to patreon.com forward slash Adam Tan, or you can click over here. Welcome back to the show once again. Hope you've been well. Hope you've been staying safe, especially during this time. I know it is improving in some parts of the world, which is great. Anyway, I'm always trying to improve the quality of my videos. So I'm experimenting with this new shot style with a desk. We're going full unbox therapy. In today's episode, I got sent 32 pairs of mallets from Marimba One. 32 pairs. It's a lot of mallets, but I'm sure if you've been watching my show for a while now, you know that receiving mallets from companies is a very normal thing on this channel, as normal as receiving mallets is. But yes, if you're new here and you haven't already, please hit that red subscribe button below to keep up my uploads. I upload brand new content like this every single week. Hit that notification bell to know whenever I upload a brand new episode. But yes, some other news while I'm at it, I actually cut my own hair last week for the first time ever because we shouldn't be going to hairdressers right now. And it's actually really, fun it's really relaxing so if you're looking for something to do that's not percussion related maybe start by cutting your hair <laughs> and yes i'm still writing the two brand new pieces a four and a third octave marimba solo and a four and a third octave marimba duo they're coming very very soon so stay tuned for that okay onto the mallets so yes marimba one 2020 mallets these are three brand new mallet series that we've never seen before on this show. They came out at PASIC last year, which I wasn't able to go to. The most interesting thing about these mallets are two things. Firstly, they're a lot cheaper than old Marimba One mallets. We always complain about how Marimba One mallets are so expensive. Not anymore. These are some of the cheapest Marimba One mallets I've ever seen. And number two, these mallets cover new areas. There's a front ensemble line in here and there's also a vibraphone line. <laughs> But yes, before I keep talking about these mallets, I do have to say that this video is not sponsored by Marimba One. They're not paying me to say nice things about these mallets. They just send them to me. You know what, I'll go one step further and I'll say that I don't actually use Marimba One mallets very regularly. I prefer to use other mallet series, which are all in the description below. You can check that out. Yeah, I've never really identified with the sound of Marimba One mallets or the feel of them, but I know some people really like them and produce excellent results with them. So it's a matter of personal preference, but that should hopefully prove to you that this video is completely Neutral. Now, up to this point, I've been saying that there were 32 pairs that Marimba One sent me. You can only see 16 here, right? Well, that's because Marimba One sent me two of each pair. Like, that is just totally overkill. I mean, thank you so much, Marimba One, but it's too much. <laughs> I was actually going to give away the additional 16 pairs at Marimba Fest, but unfortunately, Marimba Fest is not happening anymore because of the situation right now. So that's really sad, but I'll find an opportunity to give them away at some point. Okay, so we've got the Conrado Moya series, very popular series named after Conrado Moya from Spain. We've got the Front Ensemble series, which is just called the Front Ensemble series. And then we've got the Jason Marsalis series, which is the Vibraphone Mallets. And guess what? I'm gonna let you guys choose which one I review first. Which one of these mallet series do you want me to get really deep into like a normal full mallet review? So you can choose right now, Conrado Moya, Front Ensemble, or Jason Marsalis in the poll up in the top right corner over here, or you can just leave a comment down below saying which one you want me to review first. Okay, brief overviews. Let's start off with the Conrado Moya series. This is a concert soloist oriented mallet series. It really drew my attention because it's all white mallet heads. Like Marimba One normally has all kinds of colors in their mallet heads. So to have one that's just all white, really is something that I've been looking for for a long time. You can see that all the mallets that I use for daily drivers, like the Nanai Mamura series, the Pius Chang series, the Keiko Gotokus, they're all white mallets, because I love white mallets. These mallets come in six hardnesses, which is great, easy to remember. Six is the softest, one is the hardest. They look really interesting. They have a diamond-shaped head. 
construction looks really good. The new engraving looks awesome. There's a signature on the front. And the price, these are going for 49 US dollars, making them one of the cheapest artist endorsed Room One mallets because normally we'd be looking at prices well over 60 US dollars. So to have them for under 50 US dollars is a very good start. Here's a brief sound test of all of these mallets. Very interesting series for us concert players and very attractive price point. Okay, next up we have the Front Ensemble series, which a lot of you guys mistaked for round sounds because this one has the same color as round sounds. They all have this sort of bluish green tone. These mallets are the cheapest marimba mallets available from Marimba One right now. Like when I saw the price, I thought it was a misprint. The Front Ensemble mallets are available for just $34 a pair. $34 is now the new benchmark for Marimba One mallets. Like we've never seen mallets this cheap before. The round sounds weren't even this cheap. And they look more interesting than the round sounds, to be honest, because they have that very nice diamond shape. Now, Marimba One says that this mallet series can be used for both concert and marching applications, solo and ensemble applications. And that makes me believe that these mallets will be a volume seller of sorts. They'll be the most popular Marimba One series by the end of next year because they're the cheapest and because they can apparently do everything. It looks like they haven't skimmed on the shafts either. You're still getting that really nice marimba one finish with the smooth ends and all of that. Beautiful engraving. And yeah, I'm really interested to see what these sound like. So here's a brief sound test. These mallets are being used by Rhythmic Force, which is an independent open WGI group. From what I've heard, they're pretty good. I have a feeling that you guys are gonna ask me to review this one first. Just, just a feeling. And finally, we have the Vibraphone Mallet series, which is the Jason Marsalis series. And yes, Marimba One has never made a Vibraphone Mallet series before. They've had Vibraphone Mallets in Lynn Vartan's lineup. This is new ground for us. A lot of you guys thought that these were Colin Curry's because they look like Colin Curry's. They have four models, very simple, just one, two, three, four. So you got hard, medium, hard, medium, soft, and soft. These mallets are just like standard vibraphone mallets. They have nice thick rattan shafts. They are a little bit shorter and they have the same level of quality build and engraving that I'd expect from Marimba One. <laughs> Yeah, these look really interesting as just general purpose vibraphone mallets. And again, the price. These mallets are 47 US dollars, which puts it right in the middle of the road when it comes to vibe mallets. But in terms of Marimba One's overall average price structure, this is actually a lot cheaper than a lot of their mallets. So that's a welcome change. And yeah, I'll give you guys a brief test of these on a marimba because I don't have a vibraphone right now. But if you guys vote for this one, I'll try and find a vibraphone, maybe at uni or something like that. Yes, very good news for anyone who wants to have Marimba One mallets with their One Vibe, so you can have Marimba One Air Thang. So yes, that's my brief overview of Marimba One's 2020 mallet lineup. It's really pleasing for me as someone who owns a Marimba One instrument to see the company go from just making marimbas to making some mallets to making all of this now. And yes, I'd love to have your vote for which mallet series I should review. Once again, the poll is up in the top right corner, or you can just leave a comment down below. Speaking of which, if you enjoyed today's video, please give me a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. Once again, please stay safe wherever you are. I will continue to upload videos every single week for you guys so you can stay at home and watch some more YouTube. So if you haven't already, please hit that red subscribe button below to keep up with my uploads and hit that notification bell to always be notified whenever I upload a new episode. Thank you so much for watching today's episode and I'll see you guys next week for another episode of The Studio. Good night.